I think these guys need a bit of a clear out and maybe a bail. Give them a bail in a minute. Right after I have finished shredding up the last of our green waste. We'll do that first. My pork feel nice and firm for you, dear. <laughs> so far, uh, I've put four loads for the Zago. I don't know if I actually showed you the size of the pile that we had, but we had a big pile of green waste. I mean, it left was, well, from where I'm standing now, right round to the shredded material. So it was all like that, and now most of it is like that. That is what that was an hour ago before it went through there. Right then, shall we? Only thing is, while we went out for lunch, it rained. My headphones up there, I'm gonna get wet ears. We're still nice and warm, so no need for a five minute warm up. Don't go on. instead of straw for our cattle <clears throat> and then we muck it out and we uh, reuse it so this is what it turns into this is last year's I put a bit nearer so obviously we've had quite a bit of wet but basically it's composted down to well it's composted I've had what two ton of this go this morning and like that, it's worth 50% more than it is raw. So not only did I use it to bed my cattle out and save a load of money on straw, I know it's reduced in volume, but for the same volume, that is 50% more valuable than raw wood chip. So another reason why 
I bet my stock on would you? Just thought you might be interested in that. done that yeah um, I'll, I'll bring one more bucket full of uh, chip ready in it right here then we'll shut this gate we'll also shut that gate there that goes into the barn yeah. I'll open the other side and I'll put a couple of bucket fulls inside okay. if you just kick it into the corner for me do what boring eye walker eye walker why I don't know right. I don't know that's good <laughs> Right, we'll put that bale in first. Okay. side now. Yeah. Pull the wrap from the bottom to pull it back to you. That's it. That's it. Just pull it off. Go on, Ollie. <laughs> Try and keep as much of the hay as you can in. Feed her. Thank you. You said pull. Yeah, but not quite that hard. Did I didn't just tell you to yank on it, did I? Just put it hard. Right. Throw it in. There's a black bin behind me that goes in the bin.
Martin. It's very kind, he brought me back a load of green waste after we finished clearing all that oh, up. No. It's always a way, as soon as I get it tidied up and clean, somebody comes and dumps a load. Oh. It's not on. And to add insult to injury, it's my mother in law's rubbish. Don't throw stuff. So, we'll go and check that bit in there. You come and have a look and see what we're doing with the shutter then, so.
kids are really naughty <laughs> and misbehave themselves, I found a good place to put them. That's not very nice. You got hairy ears. That's, thank you very much. <laughs> it, won't, it won't hurt for long. A no. couple of minutes. You're almost useless, <laughs> but almost useful. Yes, so. I did my bit. You did your bit. For the cows. Good yeah, good. yeah, and Abby will be really grateful that you <laughs> mucked in and helped. I'll tell her what an outstanding job you did. Won't put her nose out of joint at all. Nope. No. <laughs>